Allah once again shows us his marvelous artistry of color and design in the creation of butterflies' wings. Now, let's look closely at the wings of butterflies, each of which is a work of art, and see how these wonderful designs came to be. Butterfly wings are actually transparent. These transparent wings are covered with scales of varying thicknesses. Some small scales arranged in a row on top of the wing break the light falling on them up into the colors of the rainbow. Some scales reflect a particular shade of light. What is surprising is that these tens of thousands of scales are arranged according to a definite plan. As a result of this planned arrangement, wings appear with wonderfully harmonious colors and striking designs. The colors and designs on butterflies' wings are not only strikingly beautiful, but also perform a vital function. On the wings of some butterflies, there are dark spots formed by scales. These spots have the ability to regulate heat. A butterfly that needs to warm its body opens and closes its wings so as to allow the sunlight to fall on these spots. In this way, it receives the heat it needs to be able to fly. Here is an engineering design that makes optimum use of light. The existence of such an extraordinarily beautiful sight is a proof of the supreme power and artistry of Allah. In the Quran, Allah says, Everything in the heavens and the earth glorifies Allah. He is the Almighty, the All-Wise. The kingdom of the heavens and the earth belongs to him. He gives life and causes to die. He has power over all things. The aesthetic appearance of birds' bodies is one of the most evident proofs that Allah created living things. The structure of birds reveals another perfect design. A range of color is produced by the pigments in their feathers and the play of light on them. Feathers are made of keratin and due to environmental conditions they wear out within a short time. Yet, each time a bird has its colorful wings restored because, even if their wings wear out, Allah has created a system that continues to restore them to their original condition. There are other uses for the pigments that give wings their color. They increase the wings' resilience, store heat from the sun, and prevent dangerous ultraviolet light from penetrating birds' bodies. A bird's color can serve various purposes. For example, these two birds blend into their environment thanks to their colors. This male bird you can see has a plumage of white, red and blue. By displaying this plumage with its incomparable designs, he tries to attract the female. The peacock is one of the showiest of all colorful birds. In order to attract the opposite sex, the peacock opens his splendid tail and displays the marvelous designs on it. He opens it like a fan and the delicately worked and beautifully colored designs attract the female. 
the advocates of the theory of evolution, which claims that living things came about by chance, can offer no explanation for this marvelous design. The design of the tail of a peacock is so elaborate and perfect that Charles Darwin, the founder of the theory of evolution, said, Now trifling particulars of structure often make me very uncomfortable. The sight of a feather in a peacock's tail, whenever I gaze at it, makes me sick. Darwin was uneasy over the splendor of wings because it is evident that such splendor could not have been the result of unconscious chance. The countless colors and various designs in birds' wings are proofs of the supreme artistry and knowledge in Allah's creation. He is Allah, the creator, the maker, the giver of form. To him belong the most beautiful names, Everything in the heavens and earth glorifies Him. He is the Almighty, the All-Wise.